Hello and welcome along to uh, 156 Cricket YouTube channel. We're doing another 12 ball challenge. We've got Johan back again who beat Ben last time. Thank you for doing this again. No Johan, I know you're a very busy man playing at Lords <laughs> this weekend. And then we've got the self-proclaimed director of cricket, Tom Short, who's taking him on. Tommy, fancy any chances? Um, I can't do any worse than Ben. Well, yeah, Ben, he's uh, away doing stuff with his hair and, and yeah we'll just get going all right okay so it's going to be tom to call to see who's going to be going first uh heads it is a head uh i'm going to have a ball we're going to have a ball first all right johan away you go sir go get padded up and away we go so 12 ball challenge essentially what it is is high score and 12 balls and you can be out twice. If you're out more than that, you stop there and the other bullet goes in. Simple enough. Um, so, Yohan's a left-hander, so I've put plenty of cover on the offside. I've got a, a backward point and a fine leg for the sweep and the reverse sweep, which are his favourite shots. And I've got a deep long on for uh, him coming down the track. I'm only going to be bowling some off-cutters, so I'm not expecting to... Uh, to be able to push him back so i'm expecting a bit of nifty footwork so i've kept it pretty simple trying to ball stump to stump and uh just give myself a chance my one attacking fielder is my slip i just think if i get a wicket it might put him on the back foot i know he's going to come after me so you know wickets are the easiest way to slow him down all right yeah and we've been through the field tom's been through the field he's called you out on a few things there he thinks he knows what he's going to do how you're going to play What's your what's your viewpoint of that? Mm, yeah, it's an interesting field to be fair. Uh, he's locking quite a lot of my strengths, but uh, got to adapt. So we'll see how he goes. Got to adapt. All right. Okay. So you are the professional at One Five Six Cricket. How did you get involved with all of this with Tom? Uh, well, to be honest, it's just just a weird bloke messaging me on Instagram, <laughs> and. Uh, yeah, he just asked whether he'd like to come help out, and I said yes. Um, when I came the first time, it was really, really nice. Uh, very enjoyable working with kids. I know it should be a lot about cricket and stuff, but it was more because kids at that age just want to have fun, yeah, more than just do cricket stuff. So, yeah, it's just a nice experience, and then I was fortunate enough to come back again. And That's good. So, again. you obviously, you're a professional back in Sri Lanka, yeah. first class cricket. How is the structure different from here and over there in Sri Lanka? Oh, yeah. I just think back, back home, it's just because more pressure on you to do, do well. And here, you just come play free and just like his whole thing he just enjoys so is Sri Lanka isn't cricket is cricket the number one sport in Sri Lanka so uh, yeah, there's a yeah. bit more intensity yeah, about yeah. it right, okay and been to Australia uh, no, no no okay that's a bit shit for me asking that question <laughs> all right India been to England okay so played in India as well yeah I played one now you yeah. say Sri Lanka's intense is it how how intense is it in, in India uh, just, just played a few games there um, in, cause it's such a big country it's just I guess it would be a bit more intense than back home to Sri Lanka alright ok shall we get started then yeah. ok so unlike last time we're on a proper wicket today it's slightly used as you can see with a green top that means um, something that the ball will move around I think I don't think it's going to grip in turn for spin Tom is a little off spinner, so I don't think that's going to have too much effect for Johan. So I'm expecting some big shots down the ground, I reckon. <laughs> so first ball of the 12 ball challenge will begin now with Tom uh, to Johan, and away we go. There we go. So is that just a two there? No, that's going to be one. Come on, there. I'm not mid wicket. I mean, that's one. I'm going to give it one. So off the mark yeah. straight away. So it's one to Johan. Oh, ho, ho, ho. no, <laughs> that's got <laughs> over, really. That's that's, that's four. four. That was hit <laughs> in front of square. So that's four to mid wicket. Yeah, it went there. 
That's four. Oh. Back, 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 back. <laughs> All right, five off two. First boundary done and dusted there, Johan. Yeah, coming good off the bat? Yeah, yeah, lots of value. Very good, very good. One! Straight, straight to square leg. It's in there. That's going towards me. That's going that way. I believe that that is going straight over there. The fielder is at square leg. That's another four for me. Oh. <laughs> so that's nine off the first three balls. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho! A little bit of spice about the boy. So, yeah, and what happened? What happened there on the pitch? Oh, it just where did it where did it land about? Something here. Well, I was trusting the pitch report, and someone said there's no turn. So there was no turn. <laughs> it it, it bounced did a bit. <laughs> That's just one. Just tick around the corner to fine leg. I'll take that there. once. Oh. Was there enough juice in that to go? All? I don't think so. I think that's just going to be one bounce four again. Yeah, yeah. So that's that's four, yeah. 13 off five. Last ball of the first over. After this ball, he will be allowed to change the field round. Yeah. That's just one. They're yeah. in quickly on there. So 14 off 6, Johan, oh, you're seeing it well, obviously. Yeah. A lot better than the last time round. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good start to be fair. Well, I'll take 14 off of this, though. Anything nice to say about Tom's bowling? Uh, well, to be fair, ball, ball, really good ball. But the other one's maybe a bit too short. So 1 out of 5. <laughs> well, you said it. Yeah. Oh, 1 out of 6, though. Yeah, that didn't go well, did it? Uh -huh. Yeah, short. Yeah. Absolute rubbish. You know, you're playing against a proper Greek here. You got to get it full, haven't you? Well, he can't hit you down the ground if you bang it in short. True, but length was wrong and capitalised, didn't he? Pick the gaps. That's how you should bat. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Nice clean contact. Aim for the uh, aim for the gaps. Kept it simple. Going to change the field. Uh yeah. I'm going to be. Uh, I'm going to be a Do little bit now. more negative. Obviously, it doesn't really matter about taking wickets now. So I'm going to put my man back here. I'm going to bring. This gentleman across into a, a mid wicket, and then I've got a little bit of cover on the leg side. Just got to get it up there, haven't I? Got to so you've, sort of taken, you've taken the slip fielder out. Yeah, I mean, I got one that one with a little bit of turn that beat the uh, beat the edge, but you know, I was just dropping it too short. Simple as that, really. All right, we'll go again for over two. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, ho, a little paddle. Just one, yeah. Well, that, that's a dot, yeah, you're not chasing. Conveniently, the bike is where the fielder is. So that's worked out well for all involved. That's got to be out. <clears throat> yeah, that's a stumping, we'll give you that. <laughs> <On the chart. laughs> 40. Oh, it's just one again. One, two. Oh, I... No, no I the, keep, the keeper's not... <laughs> No, no. <laughs> He's just hit him in the ribs. <laughs> that's four, it's all. That's got to be a dot. He's just hit the wicket keeper. No, wicket that's keeper's two. Here. I think you've. there's been a fumbled two on the way through there. Oh, that's a dot. That... Two? Two. Two of a mid off. Yeah. It's not going for six, going over no. the top of the It's, it's landing in the no man's land. It's landing there, isn't it? Yeah. Two runs, so what's that, Johan? 20 scored? 20, yeah. 20 scored. Well done, Johan. You're a lot better <laughs> scoring than last time. Yeah, yeah. You're happy with that? Yeah. But there's but... more runs out there, perhaps? Yeah, probably second over. Should have capitalised a bit more. But to be fair, tumble well, better second over, so all good. All right, so we'll let you depad. We'll yeah, let you pad up. Good. Tom, you feeling confident of catching 20? 21 to win? 
I'm going to give it a go, but I mean, one thing I'd say is just when you when you lucky enough to bowl at players who are playing the pro game, they just hit it so cleanly. So, absolute fantastic opportunity to have a go at doing that, and uh, you know, massive thank you to Johan for giving up his time to let me get smacked around. But at the end of the day, I got him out. He got a hat trick at the weekend as well. So we'll let those two get sorted out, and we'll come back. And uh, when they're ready. Okay, Johan, you're bowling now. You're coming off some good form. You want to tell us about your hat trick at the weekend? No, oh, I was just got eight man to. Very modest man. All right, so Tom's back and he's a right hander. Yeah. What have we got set up for him today? Yeah, uh, I'm just thinking I'll have an extra field inside just to create a bit of pressure. I am. In the first hour. He's never um, seen me back. Yeah, never yeah, helped me see me out. Oh, so you're only back. going with four out. Max yeah. has seen me back. Just, just to <laughs> stop the game off to a slow start. Yeah create a loose shot perhaps, yeah, create, create intense pressure, pressure yeah. from an imaginary field. <laughs> okay, I like the idea. So we've got a couple of men at four in close, five in close, can't count, and three out on the leg side to stop him out. So you're encouraging the big offside shot and you're going to what, swing it or spin it back through the gate, is that the plan? Yeah, we'll see, yeah, that's the plan. Eh? All right, okay, you get to the end of your mark, roll your arm over. <laughs> Tom, you want to come in? What do you think of the field down there? Um, you've seen me bat more than anybody, so you, you figure it out. What do you think, Max? I'd say it's pretty pretty accurate, to be fair. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. I can't. I was just trying to think, where can you not score runs? <laughs> well, it's, it's Probably been... if you get a little tickle, you have to yeah. play see if you can play behind. Yeah, I think... The, uh, the yeah. scoops. Yeah, I think just... To be honest with you, I'm just going to have a bat. <laughs> however, however many runs I get, I get. But I'm going to have a bat. I'm going to have a have a have a go. If it's a bad ball, I'm going to hit it. But otherwise, I'm just going to look to rotate the strike. And my aim is to uh, is to keep myself in the game as long as I can. That's that, my focus. That's off. the most village cricket advice I've ever heard. I think. Well, it and is. That's isn't said it? in every change room yeah. up and down the country. <laughs> just have a bat. Oh, we need 10 off 100, do we? I'll just have a bat. Well, I'm, I'm going to, I've got 12 balls, and if I can take it down to the last two and still be in the game, I'm going to be happy. That's, That's my focus. What is it, it's 21 to win. 21 to win, yeah. All so right, if I can okay. take it down to the last two, I'm going to be happy. That's right, my focus. Okay. Go well, sir. Yeah. Okay, so Johan's going to be bowling. Now he's coming in right arm around the wicket, and Tom needs 21 to win. Johan, away you go. Oh... That's yeah, it's one off the first ball, I'm afraid. Oh There could be two there. Yeah, I'm thinking it's gone through the gap. I'm i I'm giving him two. I hit that. Two. I hit that. No, I hit it. Quite well, it's one. Oh, okay. Got fair there. I've seen it. He had to come round and put a slide in and fumbled a bit. I'd say, I'd say it was either four or one, and I'd say it was one. All right. As much as I'd love a boundary. Four or three. Halfway through the first over. Slower ball. Oh. It's got to be four. Yeah, that's four. Eight or four to whilst your hand's fetching that ball. You're going at the run just around about the run rate, eight or four so far. That's four saved you, hasn't it? <laughs> yeah, I mean you know, Johan's a batter, isn't he? So you know, this is the opportunity to have a go and like I say, have a bit of fun. I've got eight balls to go. I'm just gonna try and keep myself in the game as long as I can. And uh hopefully, hopefully I'll make a mistake. What's that? Thirteen off eight now. Thirteen off you're, eight. You're um, back the batter from this situation. Yeah, you, you would in a normal game, but I mean, you know, there's a, there's a massive standard difference between me and Johan. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna, like I say, keep myself in the game as long as I can. Hopefully, I'll make a mistake. Um, I'm not overthinking it. I'm just gonna try and take each ball as it comes. I've got a few ideas where gaps are, but I'm focused on each ball. That's that's my aim, really. Okay. So whilst Johan's looking for the ball, we'll talk about what is. 156 cricket coaching and this is the man himself 156 what's it all about and why 156 uh so 156 cricket coaching we are a small independent uh, coaching company based in leeds we work with players of all abilities and our focus is on having as much fun as we can through cricket 
Uh, we're very fortunate that all of our coaches are either ECB advanced coaches or professional cricketers. So that's what makes us slightly unique. And like I say, our focus is on about trying to create as many opportunities to do affordable cricket and have as much fun as we can while we do it. Yeah, we're on the professionals. You've had some test players, <laughs> test openers for the West Indies have come down and got involved. That was a big hit. Saw <laughs> online. Yeah, so we've we've been very fortunate over the last few years. So obviously our, our resident professional is Johan, which is an absolute um, an absolute pleasure to have him down with us for pretty much all the events that we do, cricket camps, masterclasses, etc. But we've been very lucky. We've had um, Cameron Fletcher, the New Zealand A wicket keeper. We've had um, Shane Mosley, West Indies uh, Test match opening bat. Uh, ben Code of Yorkshire's been down. Um, so we've been we've been very fortunate. I think we're, we've had twenty players work with us over the last couple of years who are playing professionally all across the world. So we've had uh, Big Bash, uh, IPL, um, T Twenty Blast um, players come down, bring their experience and their their training methods, the way that they work, and our juniors have been able to tap into that knowledge, which is, like I say, all at affordable prices, which is what the aim of the game is for us. Can you see there's a, yes, having fun's important, but has you seen a difference in the kids as they got better? Um, yeah, I think, I, think, I think the thing is we're, we, we deal with kids who are very young to going into that age where they sort of maybe lose interest in cricket and getting players who have played at a certain level to come down and encourage and give advice and give feedback and give honest feedback, it, it makes a massive difference. If you've got sort of a 14, 15 year old who's maybe falling out of love with cricket, having somebody who's played at the, you know, in the top tiers of the game, give them advice, give them compliments, give them support. It, it does, it makes a massive difference and it encourages them to play. And that's something that we, we try and try and do as much as we can. All right, okay, so Johan couldn't find that ball. He's got a new one. Away you go. Go <laughs> back and ball, cut shot for. Uh, it's, no, it's still two. It's gone through slip. You haven't got any. Yeah, we did Cover him. Four run. Oh, I'm stopping yeah, that. Yeah, I think that's four. What? Yeah. Is that going over the top? Who's stopping that? So, Wilhand's back looking for the ball again. <laughs> so, in the meantime, so you've mentioned you, you've had up to around about 20 professionals come down and help you out yeah. could you put together a little six aside of those 20 guys and girls who you'd say would be your six aside team oh gosh um okay so i'm going to pick it on cricketing ability rather than the sessions that they ran because we've been very fortunate every pro that's come down has delivered a an excellent session for us and the feedback's always been really positive but in terms of cricket i'm going to go with uh Clinton Perrin, uh, Australia A batter. I'm going to go with. I'm going to go with Shane Mosley, West Indies Test player. He was fantastic. Great session as well. Um, I'm going to have. I'm going to pick Johan in a, in a batting third. I've got to pick Johan for the team. Um, there's nobody. There's nobody who who does more work for one five six other than myself. And Johan does a lot of work that is very much. Uh, yeah, he does a lot of the donkey work in the background that people maybe don't know and don't, um, don't appreciate and we are very lucky to have him doing that. I'm going to have uh, Cameron Fletcher at four, um, absolute machine very, of a batter. Very bowler heavy this. Uh, well, no, no, we've got batter. Heavy. Yeah, well, I mean, I've got, I've got my three batters. I've got Cameron Fletcher, top quality all-rounder at four, wicket-keeping. I'm going to have... Uh, do, 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 do. I'm going to have a spinner. I'm going to go with uh, uh, Marin Mishra, uh, just taking his 100th wicket in the uh, first class cricket in the Raj Trophy. He's a fantastic uh, bowling all rounder. And I'm going to go with um, Ben Code at six. I mean, one of the best, one of the best bowlers in county cricket in England. Um, yeah. Best, right. Yeah. So that, cool. I'm pretty confident best, with that. You need team. to get in there. Johan's yeah. bored. Sorry, Johan. <laughs> Johan has just made one change to the field. He's moved the man back onto the boundary. So down the ground there are boundary riders. The pressure, the idea to to build pressure with four men only outside the circle has not worked. And Tom now only needs seven off the final six deliveries. Oh! 
Hot spray again. Pick me up. Nah, yeah, that's a dot ball. Just a dot ball. <laughs> oh, Johan's admitted white ball straight away, so. <laughs> Well, there you go, there's just... Oh, if only you had a slipping current. That's going to be, should we say, streaky two? Yeah. It's four or five now, Tom. Yeah. You are in the you are in the favourable position here. If you had a slipping, that would have been interesting. Yeah, well, I said earlier in our, in my, uh, when I was bowling at Yellow, and you've got to be aggressive. Um, I think the thing I found really interesting now is that Having put the player back, I'm now just looking for the single, and that's actually brought you brought me into the yeah, mistake because I'm just focused on getting the one. So I think really just go back to batting every ball rather than thinking this is what I'm going to do. If that makes sense, yeah. I think really just got to take the ball as it comes rather than just thinking I'm going to take a single every ball. Well, you could just put it there for four times, and you. I, I could, but you know, Johan well, is a, is a, a big yeah, shot. Yeah, well, the thing is, you know, Johan is a better bowler than I am a batsman. So if I predetermine what I'm going to do, as I can clearly see, it's not going to work. So I think take every ball as it comes. That's when I've been doing better, and just wait for wait for the ball to be dropped a bit short, and you know, send him back to Sri Lanka happy. Forget everything I've said, it's free off free. <laughs> There's one down the ground. Just one again. <laughs> I'd have brought everyone in from the get go. <laughs> So that is epitome of a ring field. And then you've got, you've got your cow corner. Yeah. Never hit a ball to cow corner in my life. Keeping cow corner out there? Yeah, just for the mess of Oh, right, okay. Before we finish, yeah. whilst, we're still, whilst your decision can't be biased, is Tom better than you thought? <laughs> have you been put a subpar in your bowling? Yeah, or have no, I you... been against you the entire time? I think it's just better well, to be fair. Uh, maybe a few additions, but I think he's better ball. So. Well, that is a that is a ring field, really, isn't it? Yeah. He's, he's saying he's got to go hit over the top. Got to go over the top, Tom. Yeah. All right. One off one. Oh, <laughs> scores are tied. He keeps it. He defends it. I don't really know what happens now. Do we just call it a tie? Oh, they're shaking hands. They're calling it a tie. Well done, everybody. So, Johan, got 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 some bottle about you there, haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> uh, good ball, there. No, okay. How have you lost that, Tom? I I haven't lost. I've got a I've got a tie. I came into it as the as the underdog, and I'm uh, you know I'd say it was a moral victory. It was well, mine. In fact, you know, as an Englishman, we're going to claim moral victory as the, the prize. Saying, ask Tom who was the higher betting average. Well, he bottled them. Oh, oh well, yeah. If play cricket was a was our uh, standard, I like to go off uh, Johan's ESPN cricket stats, which are slightly higher than my non-existent ones. Yeah. All right, so there we are. Thank you very much, and uh, yeah, we'll see you next time.